Hello Taurus, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And it will be from the 29th of March to the 4th of April 2021. I had to think then. <laughs> so let's pull your first card and see what we have for you. Message for our lovely Taurus please, 29th of March to the 4th of April 2020. What do we have for Taurus? Oracle card for Taurus, please. Okay, thank you. Card has fallen out. We have, oh, number 28, knowledge. Let me connect above and below. Let the knowledge of ancestors flow, learning something. I mean, that could be in terms of education, qualifications. You might be learning of something as well, you know? Um, maybe from somebody telling you something. It can be that energy too. Um, you're meant to know it anyway. I mean, there's definitely an energy of... It's significant to you this week. Okay. Message for Taurus, please. Message for Taurus, please. Angels for the week. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's just a really nice confirmation of what we were saying, Taurus. I, I, yes. It definitely feels for some of you, you're getting some information, enlightenment. Call it what you will back this week. We have the yes card, what you've been asking for, what you've been hoping for. Something to do with this knowledge energy. Very nice energy, though. Very nice confirmation from the universe. So... We're just going to pull three cards, then we'll clarify, go deeper into the message. And it won't resonate with everybody, Taurus, so just take what resonates with you. Okay, so what do we have for Taurus, please? 29th of March to the 4th of April, 2021. Message for our lovely Taurians, thank you. Message for Taurus. Tower in your challenge position. Page of Wands is the advice from Spirit. Three of Coins. Hmm. Message for Taurus, please. Message for Taurus. Can we clarify the cards on the table, please? For Taurus. Thank you, that flew out, nine of coins. The hermit. And the six of wands. Oh my goodness, I've got the page of wands twice. Taurus. I definitely feel this tower, the tower in this aspect, in this challenge position, I'm feeling for some of you, you could have been hit by the pandemic. It's not limited to that, but I think it's definitely hit your money, career, finance area. Um, the tower energy is a card of change, deep change, a life changing event. So yes, it could be what the whole world has been going through the pandemic and how it's changed um, our lives. It can also be... Um, something personal to you either way this tower is the tearing down of the old the universe you know sends this lightning to test how strong this tower is and it's found wanting it's found to have weakness so it comes down so that you can rebuild a new tower something far stronger stable secure it's, it's all part of the evolution how we grow how we evolve we tear down and build many towers in our lives so there's definitely this energy of you've been through deep change here, some kind of life-changing event can be linked with some truth or um, revelation. But it feels in this energy that something has hit you in terms of money and finances. Because the nine of pentacles is, is an energy of luxury. It's an energy of abundance and financial uh, success. But it feels in this aspect, you've been working to get back on your feet. And working hard. I mean, you know, in the challenge position, this, this energy can be 
about really, you know, uh, it is taking over your life in trying to get back on your feet. You know, it has dominated your energy, so to speak, in terms of trying to bring material gain back into your life. Um, and doing all the practical things, you know, using your practical skills, resources, abilities to align to that new abundance as well. So it definitely feels in this energy you've been hit financially. Finance, career, business, call it what you will. But, you know, the beautiful thing is, Taurus, some of you are getting the answer that you want. And this is the knowledge. It's interesting. I, I feel this knowledge, you're learning something. Um, learning of something it, it, you know you might have been through some kind of period of development here where you have bettered yourself where you have learnt new skill sets where you've had more professional qualifications or gained more professional qualifications to be more attractive in the job market learning new skills to set up a new business you know I mean it can be this kind of energy the message is, whatever this knowledge is, it served you well, but I'm also feeling with these two energies, you're getting the answer that you want, which is yes. I think someone's going to say yes to you this week. Um, because, you know, this page of ones appearing twice is a message of good news, and it feels to do with some kind of opportunity, and it's exciting opportunity. It's connected to your heart and soul. You're getting some kind of answer that you want here. It feels very beautiful and it's aligning you to exactly where you need to be. Hermit is a card of alignment. So is the tower. Even though this is difficult, you will look back. Uh, generally with the tower, we look back in months, years to come and we're like, oh, thank goodness that happened. I understand now why this had to happen because it was to align me to where I need to be now. So we do look back on tower moments and suddenly realise you know, why things happen the way they did and the hand of divine orchestration in all things, you know? The good news is bringing in, and I love this energy at the end as well, such good, you know, it definitely feels like good news to do with some kind of uh, opportunity connected to your heart and soul. Um, Six of Wands is a card of victory, of significant achievement. And the Three of Coins is the beginnings of success, manifesting new success. And it feels to do with money, career, finances. I mean, you might also have been hitting your home, in which case this can be about, you know, doing up a new home. Uh, some of you might be looking, have got some qualifications to do property development or things to do with property, you know, things like interior design. I mean... <laughs> you know, I can go on intuitively forever with this kind of um, specific detail. But you kind of get what I'm saying, Taurus. The, the beginnings of success is here. This can be a, a team partnership, business collaboration, the three of coins. It can also be to do with, you know, a new job and a new company and excelling yourself. You know, the beginnings of excelling yourself. You're building this new tower in your life. You know, step by step, brick by brick. There's definitely this energy of building this new tower, something far more solid, secure uh, for the future, you know, and this is the beginnings of success, financial career, uh, business success. So it feels very, very beautiful. Love the energy. Love the energy. Um, pages are messengers, the beginnings of something new, the beginnings of change. You have two of them. And you have also cards of alignment here. So you're absolutely being aligned to some kind of victory, significant success this month. And it, it, it definitely, this, this month, this week, uh, but it definitely feels for you that there is some good news, a message of good news. And I feel someone's giving you the right answer. Getting the right answer. Someone is telling you yes. Or you're saying yes to somebody. So what do we have for Taurus, please? Message for Taurus. message for Taurus yeah what did I say what did I say divine timing we have the tiger good things come to those who wait <laughs> it's a lovely reading Taurus really love it so I hope you enjoyed the reading if you did please do like share and subscribe I hope it's a wonderful week for you all and I will see you next time thank you